Hello, Scorpio. This is your daily reading for the 9th through the 10th. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you are new to the channel, welcome. Please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel. And um, we're going to go ahead and start with an angel prayers card for my Scorpios. The Miracle of Forgiveness, Archangel Jeremiel. Okay. Thank you, Jeremiel, for helping me understand the process of forgiveness. That is your theme for today, okay? So let's see what's going on with you guys with the tarot and see how that ties in. Okay. Ooh. Ace of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. And the Eight of Pentacles. Huh, lots of Pentacles here. Maybe an Earth sign that you're dealing with here. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or a lot of you are just focused on the coin. Focused on your money. <clears throat> Some of you are holding on to um, trying not to extend to someone an offer, maybe of reconciliation, getting back together, um, you know, wanting to build, but at the same time, you know, just trying to not try to keep to yourself and, you know, just focus on whatever business you have started, whatever job you have started, just really trying to get that coin. And I think that is a lot of you. Um, you know, trying to take the focus off of love here, okay? I think a lot of you are probably needing to forgive someone, even forgive yourselves for that matter, all right? Let's see why this is happening here. What is the cause of this? Hmm, Nine of Swords, Death, Three of Wands. All right. So under the Ace of Pentacles, we have the Nine of Swords. I feel like, you know, a lot of you, like I said, are wanting to, to start over with somebody. You're wanting to offer something to somebody, but you are really not sure if it's a good idea. Um, I feel like for a lot of you as well, that... There's something that you wanted to do for a long time because, you know, these pinnacles for me are like, this is like you staying in one spot or one um, feeling for a very long time. Now, I think that there is a feeling here of being put out feeling like somebody was not there for you. And this energy can go vice versa too, okay? Um, because, you know, I'm looking at the Four of Pentacles with the Ace of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles. So I'm feeling like, you know, you feel like somebody was not there for you. They didn't have your back. And so now you're feeling like, you know, you know, I take care of myself. It's all me. Nobody else. And that's where you're most comfortable here with this four of pentacles. Four is a very stable. So you don't want to get hurt. You don't want to open yourself up, I feel. Um, but being that this is ended, I do feel like you know, this is a Scorpio card here. I feel like there is a change coming within you. Um, and now you're like, you're trying to work on yourself is what I feel. You're trying to work on opening up. Um, you're trying to work on even addressing this new beginning with someone. Maybe you guys feel like somebody has committed themselves to someone else. And that's possibly what has got you worried here. But this to me says you're worrying for nothing. Or it's not as bad as you may think that it is. If somebody has started dating, then they may just be dating. It may not be anything serious, you know, like that. And that's what I mean by it may be it may not be as bad as you think it is. 
Okay, so even if they are seeing someone, they may not be in a solid, committed relationship. It may just be that they are dating right now. Does not mean that um, you know you can't reach out to them that you can't speak your peace you can't get something off of your heart that you're feeling right now i feel like a lot of you guys are holding on to this relationship as well okay and you know you're 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 working on yourself but i think there's certain things there's something that you're missing there's something that you're not really wanting to see here i feel okay i think that a lot of you are probably um wanting someone to approach you waiting for someone to come towards you because right now i think you're just focusing on working probably putting a lot of your energy into that okay so let's see what the outside influence is here yeah you, you're just not trying to you're not really trying to reveal too much. Um, you're, you're really trying to stay closed off. You're trying to shield yourself here. Focusing on work. You see how the strength is um, looking right at the Eight of Pentacles. You're trying to like dive into work to avoid making this decision about this person that you're thinking about here. Okay, but I feel like too, you're needing the strength to really take a good look at what you actually do have going on because there is something that you're missing here because you have your back turned to the Eight of Pentacles. Like you, you're, you're wanting this connection, but then you don't. It's like, you know, you're back and forth about it, but this is having the strength to do something that, you know, may not be that easy for you. And sometimes that is basically looking at ourselves to see, you know, objectively, and that's hard to do, you know, where you can possibly improve, okay? Yeah. And then I feel too that, I feel strongly that if you guys are wanting to approach someone, that they are possibly like you know they're shielding themselves as well and not really wanting to be heartbroken but i feel like if you did approach this person that they would possibly be open to it here okay let's see what the advice is for you guys six of wands go for it Whatever question you have in your head, this is telling me that you need to go for it. Okay? Very Leo energy here. Leo energy here. Maybe a fire sign again, like, like I said, that you may be dealing with. Aries, Leo, Sag. We have air here. Um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And um, my Scorpio friends, that's what I have for you. And I'll speak with you soon. Bye now.